the Warfield Mayor's Hurdle is next then. And oh, there's a fairly small field for this one. It's a three mile grade two. Now the top one is Scorched Earth for Leon van Rensburg, Cloud Mambo and Initial Legacy for Craig Allen, Natural Lamont Castle for Vinnie Gerard, Sharp Right, David Robertson, Stay Alert, David Hooley, Wadia Smiles for Darren Thompson and World on Fire for Joshua Sutherland. So just seven of them meant eight, sorry, and they're called in and away they go. And maybe not the classiest looking field for this group group two as they get to the first of the thirteen. And they're all safely over that one with Scorched Earth. Just about the early leader, but now Ryder on the far side, Natural Lamont Castle is coming through to take it up in the green jacket with Stay Alert in the purple. Now in second, but there's only about five lengths first to last at this stage. They've got 13 flights to take in all. This is the second of them, and they're all over that one, although the grey Wadia Smiles didn't jump it all that well. And is the back marker, but Natural Lamont Castle has got across to the fence and is in the lead. And bowling along in front. Leading by about three lengths to the Craig Allen Pear Cloud Mambo Initial Legacy. Then three in a line behind that. Scorched Earth, Sharp Right and World on Fire. And stay alert in the purple jacket and the grey wider smiles the back marker. And that's your field of eight then as they race down towards the third of the 13 flights. And the leader skips over that one nicely with a six length lead I would say to Sharp Right in second. The rest of them pretty tightly grouped and all appear to be going well. Why do your smiles can record from that mistake earlier on without any problem? And he's bowling along nicely at the back. Natural Mont Castle takes the fourth and skips over it really well. And all over that one nicely as well. Initial Legacy's just dropped back a little bit, but still a long way to go yet. They're not even inside the final two miles yet. And Natural Mont Castle leads by about seven there to Sharp right in second. And then World on Fire is third. Cloud Mambo on the inside of that one. On the inside of that one on the rail is Scorched Earth. Tucked in behind the purple jacketed Stay Alert. And then Initial Legacy. The second of the Craig Allen runners in the green and yellow hoops. The grey Wadia Smiles running in. Um, Darren Thompson's with the colours today. At the back as they take number five. And they're all safely over that one. And they're racing up the uh, home straight. They'll take this next flight which will be the last on the next circuit. Tremont Castle just being steered into it by the jockey. Leads by about six or seven lengths. Stood off it but got over it nicely. They all jumped it well. And cheered on by the big crowd. An empty royal box as they make their way up and past the stand. And past the winning post shortly. And then they'll swing out right handed for a full circuit of the track. And it's Natramont Castle that's in the lead from Sharp Right in second. Cloud Mambo is three and Stay Alert's moved up into fourth. Then World on Fire is fifth and then Initial Legacy Scotched Earth. And finally, the wider smiles, the back marker. And Gray been at the back throughout, but plenty close enough. And we know from previous races it's plenty good enough as well. But Natramont Castle then racing downhill towards the next. Still enjoying a six length lead. And the rest of them. Seem quite content to let that one bowl along in front. Moves down to the seventh. Skips over that one nicely as well. Jumped into second there. Stay alert. With Cloud Mambo on its inside. Then Sharp Right. World on fire. Initial Legacy Scorched Earth and Wilder Smiles. Not much change to the racing order so far as they get to flight number eight. A mistake there by World on fire. Let's just seen that one shuffle back a couple of places. They continue down this back straight, all the way down towards Swindley Bottom, and it's Natural Mont Castle that's in the lead, skipping over flight number nine. With Stay Alert second and Cloud Mambo third. Sharp right is four and Scoot Earth is five. Then Initial Legacy, World on Fire now, moving back into it on the outside, and Wadia Smiles just a couple of lengths behind. The lead is now down to a little more than three. As we get down to the final mile of the race in Natural Mont Castle. He's only by two and a half now to stay alert in second. Cloud Mambo on the inside third. World on fire recover from that mistake on the outside is four scorched earth just in between them. 
Then Nishan Legacy and Sharp right together. Wilder Smiles is now coming into it as they skip over number 10. And now the lead is down to less than a length. But it still belongs to Nathan Ramont Castle. On his outside, stay alert. Wilder still world on fire. Looks like he might be the one to take it up as they make their way towards the final five furlongs in this race then. And it's Nathramont Castle, World on Fire, stay alert, almost three line as they take the third last, and over that one, World on Fire landed in front. World on Fire has taken it up, stay alert has gone second, Cloud Mambo on the outside, Nathramont Castle now comes under pressure, Initial Legacy is now sweeping around the outside, Scorched Earth is still there as well, Sharp Right and Wildly are smart and not out of it. It's Initial Legacy then who's burst into the lead on this turn, and Initial Legacy has now quickly gone two clear of World on Fire in second, stay alert third, Nathramont Castle sticking on in there on the inside of Cloud. Mambo, Wadia Smiles trying to run on same as Scorched Earth and Sharp Right but it's in Nishar Legacy who's gone for home over the second last, jumps it nicely, a better jump on the inside though by World on Fire these are the one, two, third is Cloud Mambo stay alert, fourth trying to get into it, still Sharp Right and Scorched Earth, they're coming down towards the final flight then now, and it's in Nishar Legacy from World on Fire on the near side come to this final flight, over it they go they both jump it well, Nishar Legacy gets away from the wall, World on Fire on the inside is trying to close, but it's in Nishar Legacy into the final furlong, looks to be going strongly enough now, World on Fire's trying to get there but not closing fast enough, and as they race up towards the line, this is going to be a win for Initial Legacy up the line, it's Initial Legacy, the winner, World on Fire is going to be second, Cloud Mambo third, Scorch Earth, four and Sharp Right, Stay Alert Wilder, you smiles, and long time leader Nathramon Castle ended up at the back it's a win for Initial Legacy and Craig Allen taking it a 1-3 for him, so there is an initial legacy for Craig Allen, the winner. World on Fire, Joshua Sutherland, second. Cloud Mambo for Craig Allen was third. Scorched Earth, Leon Van Rensburg, fourth. And Sharp Right for David Robertson was fifth.